he would flex on computers machines. He was gonna buy a fresh new machine for Brothers of Girl, which he did buy that fresh new machine for Brothers of Girl. You know, and this was I was just gonna take this with me. I may have been a few, a longer than a week before that. I don't remember exactly how long it was, but he told me that. He said I could take that computer with me. And another thing that people have been saying like crazy, like, you know, trying to accuse me of being lazy because I wanted to work for the church in the very beginning. Pastor Anderson is the one that suggested that to me in the very beginning. And I agree with Pastor Anderson, of course, but I know I'm probably lazy because of that. I wanted to invest all my time in the very beginning in the church. I wanted to start working full time for the church right away if it was possible. I mean, I, I was moving there for the church and starting the church. Of course, I wanted to focus all my time on the church if that was possible. So he was gonna allow me. Now you think he's gonna let me take my computer, give me all these other things, but the printer. Now that's a real big, you know, situation. You really can't do. You can't purchase that printer. When he's gonna buy the camera, all that other stuff. It just makes zero, zero sense. Now. When I purchased this, you know, when I purchased the, uh, the, uh, well, no, 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 let me, let me, I want to make this very, very clear. Everything's going on. So I called back, I called into Staples, and I want to explain to them what I wanted to do. The reason why I called in was because I wanted to pay for the, down here, I wanted to pay for the printer on the church card, and I wanted to pay for the three-year protection plan on my personal card. I didn't want to take advantage of the church. I don't want to, I'm getting a three-year protection plan. That's another thing I got from Pastor Anderson. I used to never do that, but he's big on getting protection plans and stuff like that. I started seeing, you know, when we had Brother Garrett's uh, computer go down one time, the importance of having something like that. And I, that's why I got the protection plan. We're going to be using it. It's, you know, a $1,000 printer half off. It's pretty important that I have some sort of protection plan. I don't want to take advantage of the church. And Pastor Anderson can, can testify to this as well, that this is not the first thing, time that I had done things like this. Um, I, when, when we were doing Faithful Baptist Church North, it was clear that that was a part of my duties of the church. But for like the first six months of the church, I didn't pay myself for any of the time when I worked. And this can be proven on my time sheets. Do you want to go to my time sheets and show? The first six months, I believe it was, I didn't pay myself at all for the Sunday mornings when I went out to Faithful Baptist Church North. And Pastor Anderson and I had a conversation about that. He brought that up to me. And he said, you know, you're not doing that. You, you just kind of feel like it's your own personal ministry. Is that why? So he was asking and implying that I could. And then we talked about it. And, you know, he said that I could pay myself in that conversation for Faithful Baptist Church North, which was obviously given because it was a ministry of the church. And because I'm so lazy, you know, I selected the early, you know, time. And, and I allotted everybody's time. I wanted to have the eight o'clock time, so I had my whole day because I don't want to get up early. I guess. These bags are mine because I hardly ever sleep, by the way. And, uh, but I, uh,